Jackie. So, we all good? Hell yeah, we all good. We did. Yeah, you fucking ain't right, we did. So, here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us 50 cents on the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Whew. Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job. Everything about it. Anyone who knows your file. What is wrong with you? Davy! Long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked! Hey, don't worry about Trevor. Trevor's dead. It's gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. <laughs> really? Criminals are believed to escape with millions of dollars worth of gems, oh. precious stones, and hey. rings. Albert's story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I said to this guy, Hey, you gotta move these bikes. I don't know anything about that. Okay, you'll make sure this is one of them. That was pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You wanna get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you wanna you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole! Don't do it, Johnny! I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high! We all get high! But that don't Leave make it, it right! Johnny. Leave it! The crystal has got us, babe, but that don't make it right. Don't make nothing right! Not what you done with me! I'm telling Johnny, leave it! I ain't leaving nothing! Trevor! I'm talking to you, motherfucker! Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Well, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? I is that the problem here? Take off your pants, cowboy. All right, let's let's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him leave it, leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a method, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums, huh? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh. I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. Shh, I don't hey. mean nothing by it, man. I just... I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug, yeah. Shh. <laughs> Fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you, then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> Cowboys forced our hand. We gotta find the rest of the lost. You seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for her. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did just 10 minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you messing with her again. 
Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy, you mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry, what was that? Well, no, 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 you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient party of left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Oh, well, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies. All right. We follow the band back to the rest of them. Then the lost MC are out of this region for good. Yes! All right, you looking for motivation? And get me some oh, sticky yeah. bombs! Back 
Backup, brother! Ortega lives near here. Let's go see him. It's one thing messing with tweaked out bikers, but the Aztecas? Man. The Aztecas? It's just a name. Is he Illuminati as well? And a wacky? I'm one of those lizard people. I got this Chinese contact you can meet at the end. He'll buy all the meth we can cook. Our enterprise ain't just about meth. It's about guns, too. There he is. Let's wake him up. What? With the truck? No, come on. Ortega oh, runs no. the whole cow. Don't do it, man. Don't anymore. Here we go. The lost MC are out of business. The guns and crank in this area go through Trevor Phillips Enterprise, or they ain't going. Saying something don't make it true. Ah! You get the picture. They're gonna green light you after this. I don't like the way he's looking at me. We was always cool. You sure you want to do this? The shot callers ain't gonna be happy. Think about it. I thought you was crazy, man, not stupid. I think he gets it. I'll go away, man, but my people... He's looking at me. I always let you operate. I didn't have to. I don't like the way he's looking at me. The Aztecas is an international enterprise. You sure you want to do this? They're gonna green light you after this. Think about it. We was always cool. I think he gets it. The shot callers ain't gonna be happy. I think he gets the message. Let's go. Time to think. Run!
speak. You know I don't like using these things. They're listening. Then make it quick. That business thing's been set up. The Chinese guy, Mr. Chang, is at the inn. You said that on the phone? What the fuck is wrong with you, damn it, Ron? Now I'm gonna have to discipline you and you know how I feel about that. You're still banned. What about these two? Whoever wins gets banned. He's won. Ban him. I can't ban him. He's my goddamn husband. He's young enough to be your son. Ain't the internet a beautiful thing, honey? Anyway, I Ooh. saved your husband. Now get me a drink. I got a meeting. Okay, but any more bodies turn up in my bar. I swear, I will not serve you. Mr. Phillips. Ah, here he is. Yes, Mr. Chang, pleasure to meet oh, you. No, I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. You all speak Spanish, speak it to each other! Mr. Tao Chung is pleased to meet your acquaintance. Oh, yeah, he seems it. What the fuck is wrong with him? I'm out. No, don't go. Please, I beg you. If you go, his father kill me. Why do I give a fuck? You don't. But we hear that Trevor Phillips' corporation is serious business. We pay good price. Things work out, we partner, make big money. <laughs> I'm rushing! Well, let me show you the operation. This is us. Using established networks. Shit, Trevor, we ain't got long. Whoa, 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 whoa. manners, chef. These are our guests, all right? We got Mr. <laughs> Chang and his humble servant. Hey, Lao uh, Shung. <laughs> nice to meet you. Trevor, we ain't got long till they get here. Everything in its time, all right. Gentlemen, please, come check out the storage facilities. Go on. Nice, right? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Ample room inside. Mr. Cheng, please, sir, if you will. Let me out! No. So fun. Tour will recommence shortly, gentlemen. Should we get the guns? Yes, Chef. Help me! If I knew we were having visitors, what is that little spring clean? Ortega has always been cool enough.
They're coming in on the left! They gotta have the whole crew here! Go! Uh, this is extremely unprofessional! I'm starting to think they really want to kill me! They got behind us! The back of the building! Get in the cover! Tour, gentlemen. <laughs> I think we have seen quite enough. Uh, I'll swing by and sign the contracts, all right? Just ignore the bodies. Hey, Trevor. Are we still gonna cook that batch? Fuck yeah! Okay. Come quick, boss! What's going on, Ron? They were here for you. Here for you. Who was here? Them bikers. After you killed Johnny K? And they damage my stuff, huh? They smash up my home, damage my soul. Look at this, 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 this statue here of impotent rage, this fucking meant more to me than Johnny K meant to anyone, and they smashed it. Those pathetic midlife crisis, hog riding, shaven headed, fruity leather, chapped wearing fucking assholes. They're assholes, Trevor. They are. They're chap-wearing assholes. Oh, wait, 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 you little shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, <laughs> Michael fucking Townley, right? Bitch wife, two kids, 45. Find them. Los Santos is a big, big place, Trevor. There's lots of people. You are fucking useless. Huh? Find out who did that fucking robbery, all right? And if Michael Townley lives there or anyone matching his description, I'm going to kill you and your fucking cousin. Am I being clear now? Yes, Trevor. Thank you, Wayne. Now smile. Uh, yeah, uh -huh. right? That's better. Run along. <laughs> now, Ron, shall we go? I cannot believe that they fucking destroyed my statue of impotent rage. The cheek, huh? The fucking cheek of it. I gotta make a stop at ammunition. You're meeting me at the Lost MC's airfield. in your ear when I get a hold of you. Oh, what are you buying at the gun shop? I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high power scope. They say they support local business. Well, we're about to find out if that's true. Melvin! 
How you feel about brand synergy, huh? TP Industries. Ammunition. Good, because you're about to make a corporate gift of a rifle, a high-powered scope, and a suppressor. Uh, take whatever you want, Trevor. I can't afford another fire. Three brain That's cells. Tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But, but you gotta look out, because there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run. I'm up here. I don't see the hardware, but I do see a hell of a lot of bikers. Hardware's not here yet. I'm coming up. You'd get a better view from the top. Take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Trevor? You see me? You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me! That's me! Don't shoot! Well, get a move on! I'm moving! Just keep me covered, okay? Man wants to pay his respects. I ain't one. You should have seen the look on his face. There's a guy coming out of the control tower. Take him out. Shit. You gonna take him? And they all came tumbling down. Oh no! Bottom of the tower. Another guy's on his way. He's down there amongst the bodies. Okay. I'll get to him. Quick! He's about to raise the alarm! Take him out! Clean shot, Trev. There's another guy at the top of the tower. He's probably looking for his buddy. So long, sailor. Get your sights back on me, Trev. I'm scared. You're in my crosshairs again. And there's no one left to kill, so get over to that gas tank and plant the bomb. I'm on it, but there's a guy coming out of that building, I think. I can hear him. Someone's coming out the far door, man! There's another guy! Coming out of the building! Sneak up on me, okay? And watch out for the tank. It'll go up if you hit it. Someone's coming. He's gonna get me before I finish. He knows I'm here. This is it. He caught me. A bolt from the blue. Can you hear that? Chopper! Incoming! Always hated that chopper. Just fucking drive. You're bikers. It's 
I hit the chopper, everyone's gonna know we're here. Try and hit the pilot when he's settled. They might think he crashed. Might they? They might.
successfully de delivered, Ron. Now remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. You wouldn't really do that to me, would you? Beat me and you'll see. <laughs> I ain't a trained Air Force pilot like you. Military base coming up. Fly low. We don't want to show on the radar. Mexico, yeah. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? All right, T. You see, Trevor, you won. You're the better man, as if there was any doubt. I think that was adequate restitution for my impotent rage statue. That was a mighty fine statue, Trev. That was a mighty fine piece of plastic shit. But there is no price for emotional attachment. I mean, you might forego your cut to uh, alleviate my heartache. I might? Yeah, I mean, I will. Good idea. We don't have time to dwell on that now. Because we got more runs, Ron. If there is one thing that they need south of that big fence, it is guns. <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Technical expertise, hmm? managerial innovations, unstoppable. Oh, that's right. Now go. I need to meditate. Or masturbate. Or both. You sure as shit are one dumb, ignorant, white trash hillbilly, Wallace. <laughs> You're damn right! <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La 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 la. Quite in. Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle weight. And I think I have proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you, and me. Now give me some of that goddamn X. I'm afraid we want to go down a different path. What? We want to explore other opportunities. This Shut the fuck up! Our boss, Mr. Cheng's father, wants something a little larger. We want to move drugs, perhaps guns. This is my life's work. I mean, since I was a little kid, I, I dreamt big. You know, I've always wanted to be an international drug dealer and, and a weapons trader. All right, so I'm begging you. Let's make this happen. I'm very sorry. You're sorry? You're fucking sorry? I just spilled my fucking guts out to you, and you say to me you're sorry. Who are you working with? Hmm? Huh? I'm not at liberty to say... Oh, no, 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 you're at fucking liberty. In fact, I'd say you are obliged. <laughs> who? Fucking who? 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 The O'Neill brothers. The O'Neill brothers, huh? Yeah. You shitting me? No. Because those fucking O'Neill brothers, I hear a little birdie telling me that they have a bit of a problem, since one of them's gonna have to be surgically removed from the skull of the other. Fuck you guys and fuck them! Is that too much to ask? A little success, a little happiness! Trevor Phillips! Elwood O'Neill! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you!
Trevor, it's business. That wide-eyed idiot was mine. It's business, Bella. You want to discuss it? We're at the farm. Ernie, Earl, Walton, Wynn, Dale, Doyle, Daryl, Dan, all of us. Start writing those names on tombstones, because I'm on the way to your lab, and we're going to see how much of a family myth business you got when I'm done! Mm. Oh, oh, you are going to die! Jesus H. Christ! Never seen that before. I just spoke to that maniac, Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect it. Right. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. Oh, how many brothers you got, you idiot? for this, assholes! here you're not even hidden have you got it I've been trying Trevor I've been trying come on over here all right I ain't gonna hit you I've been trying I know I know uh, 
I thought you said you weren't gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley. There's two Michael Townleys living in L.S. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked the teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but she threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut then up I before asked... I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I, I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta, about the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda? Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Uh, Woo! Uh, uh, don't you ever not tell me things I want to know! Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard! Get out here! We're going to Los Santos. Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money. And tidy my shit up. Let's go, wait, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. You can suck me off. Are we gonna stop for ice cream? Um, <laughs> so, so, so we're headed to Los Santos then? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? Road trip time, buddy? If we're taking a, a road trip, we'll, like, need a car, won't we? Yeah, 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 I'm on it. Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's just my cousin there, Floyd. He's bumped in with his girlfriend someplace called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's your stop? Family's important, Wade. Not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, and fed you. Last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seen him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay, um, I got my big guys, but where are we stopping on the way? Cause you know, I'm getting kind of wet over here. For fuck's sake, another chapter of the lost descended on this fine town. Looking to mourn and maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Trevor. Pistol with the thing that makes it quiet on it. Yeah. Yeah, I took them. Those are my gifts.
the loss no more. Let's go find my old buddy. Good Michael Conway guy must have pissed you off real bad for you to want to find him so much. He didn't piss me off. The guys that... The guys that killed him? The federal government. They pissed me off. But if he's dead, who's this? Now you're starting to grasp the pertinent question. Who is this guy using my dead friend's tired-ass movie quotes? With my dead friend's alias? And my dead friend's family? The house that must have been paid for with my dead friend's stashed millions? Wow, that's a real mindfuck. Yeah, I'll show you a fucking mindfuck. I'm gonna stick my boy in your eye. It's gonna come out of your ear, huh? I, I, I didn't mean anything by that, T. Trevor, move up your eye hole, fucker! Cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? I'm ready to turn you into roadkill! Please! Don't! Ow! Don't turn me into anything! I just want to be away. Are we nearly there yet? No, Wade. Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all. Can you tell me a story? No, Wade. Let's play a game then. You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first. I'm nanotechnology. Uh, you're what? You're what? Ugh. Damn it. I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral. Hey, hey, hey. How about this? I'll tell you a story. If you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tr Tr uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. Sounds weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. This boy, he had all the talent, charisma, and guile that a boy could have. But he didn't know what to do with it. He should become a baseball player. No, he shouldn't. Because he's not a fucking sellout idiot. Or hockey player. He did for a while, but his coach accidentally had a stick jammed up his ass. What could he do? I'll tell you in a second, okay? Just let me concentrate on the road. But Trevor! Hey! Aww. That's it. That giant sprawl, Los Santos. This is the place! I seen it on the holiday card. So, this is Los Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert. It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. So, Michael, this is where dead men come back to life, huh? It's been nearly ten years, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You mother fucking fuck! I grieved for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck? I thought we were going to my cousin. About that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah. Where were we? You were saying what he could do. He, he couldn't throw, and his coach had a, had a stick accident like, like I had one. Right, right. But he could fly planes, this kid. So he signed up for the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe... Did you not You're fucking see me? Bomb villages and maybe just... Maybe drop the new. It was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluation told him he was unstable. Grounded him for life. That's terrible. It was. Sent him into a deep pit of doubt and despair. And just then, ju just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. Yes. 
Michelle! A lady troll? Yeah, yeah, tits! Yeah, tits! Like one, but no, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed by. Sometimes, he'd go into town and... And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people. And little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? Gee! For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club. And they fell in lust. And he bought her a pair of fake troll tits. Even bigger than his real troll tits. Oh. Oh. We're near Floyd Cap. I seen it on the iPhone map. I'll give you directions. Just keep on a minute. I turn right here. It's just straight over this one. This is the place, I think it is at least. Floyd! Floyd! Come up here, Trevor! Floyd, it's me, Way! Who? Me, Wade, your cousin! Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! Oh, you, Wade! <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here! He's gonna smoke meth here! Give me a fucking lighter! You can't smoke here! Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was caught in Evelyn's bed. A guy we've never proved. You gotta go. Both of you. My girlfriend? She'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait. Uh... I ain't got no booze. Well, then you go out and fucking get me something. You go too. All right. Okay. Fuck. 